It is crucial to be able to understand the console in Counter-Strike 2. You will need to use it and get comfortable with it as you progress in the game. Today, you are going to learn some must-know console commands that will make your life so much easier. First, I want to tell you about the best way to get Counter-Strike 2 skins. Thank you to the sponsor of today's video, Skins Monkey. They are one of the greatest and easiest to use CS2 trading sites out there. You can swap out the skins you do not like for brand new ones that are so much more fresh. Even skins that are trade lock can be secured by adding them to your backpack. The greatest thing about the site is that you can buy skins for so much cheaper with a 35% deposit bonus when you use my code, Kojo. Make sure to check out the freebie section where you can get a free skin just by completing tasks. On top of the bonuses, you also get a $5 bonus when clicking the link in the description. Okay, first let me show you how to enable the console. I want you to click on the settings and go to game. Here you will find the enable developer console. Slide that on yes and it will allow us to open up the console with our tilde key. This key is going to be found on the top left of most keyboards. Now what is the console? The console is your command center where you are going to be able to manipulate values in the game to make it so that your Counter-Strike 2 experience suits you the best. The first setting I want you to learn about is view model commands. These view model settings are going to allow you to change the positioning of your guns on the screen. My personal favorite view model settings are as follows. View model offset X 2.5. View model offset Y 2.0. View model offset Z negative two and view model FOV 68. As you can see, this allows me to have such a clean looking game and I personally love the way the guns look. This is going to be totally preference, but it's nice to find what works out the best for you. The next command I want to teach you about is one that you won't be able to live without after changing it. I want you to type in SND underscore VOIP volume 0.15 and you can also put this on 0.1 just test what works best for you it's going to lower the volume of your teammates mics in game it's gonna save your ears from having to hear mic spam and raging throughout the whole game you will now be able to hear if any sneaky enemies are reloading or making steps anywhere close to you one command you might find very useful is fps underscore max zero this is going to make sure that your frame rate is unrestricted and you can take advantage of what your PC can offer. It is not as important to have this at zero, but if you're going to cap it, make sure that it's above your monitor's refresh rate. The next command I am going to show you is something only my subscribers know about. It is YT underscore subscribe underscore to underscore Kojomo. Doing this will help me grow and allow me to be seen by more eyes as I work hard to produce quality content for you. All right, the last command I want to show you is a useful one in practice servers. I want you to bind a key to SV underscore rethrow underscore last underscore grenade. For me, I choose the letter P and it's gonna look like this in your console. This will allow you to test out your nades in an offline server so that you can see if your flashes or smokes are hitting. And if you wanna learn how to set up uh, practice config, you can watch this video. The SV underscore rethrow last grenade bind has been something so useful and vital in my own personal journey to the top. And it's so annoying when you don't have the bind and you have to keep rethrowing the grenade and just trying to guess if it's hitting or not. So this is very good for testing out different positions if they're going to get blinded or not. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching this tutorial. If you are looking for another useful tutorial, click the left side video. And if you are looking for an entertaining, fun video, I have something insane for you on the right here. So let's keep grinding through 2024 and doing our best. I'll catch you guys later. Peace out. And also, I want to say, if you want to become a member of this channel, you can support me like that and you can get your name on every single one of my videos, which is amazing. So peace out.